Hello and welcome everybody, my name is Table Food and today I bring you some awesome notes. So I just bought this game into the Winter Sales from Steam and I've been playing it through with my friends and it is awesome. So let's see what is it about. So I won't go through all the options that is here, I'm just gonna jump in and battle and show you a bit of the game. So I already played a lot of it so I have unlocked all the characters and I have leveled up a little bit so there's a ranking system as well so let's try playing this character now so this guy is kind of a poison dealer so here on the screen after you choose out your character you have to choose out the loadout so if you ever played any MOBA game like uh, League of Legends or Dota uh, it's pretty in the same style except it's in 2D and more action uh, oriented to uh, the player killing player instead of just doing the lanes and the beginning and here is going to be the item that I can buy in the shop so it's going to be upgrade for my skills not exactly an item that will do that depending on this but more likely what my skill is going to do so I can have a lifesteal effect on one of my attacks or I can have more damage or healing stuff and all kind of stuff like that that you can have to your character skills and when you level up in the game because each game you play you're gonna get experience uh, you can uh, get new skill well new items to buy from the shop as you level through so I'm still missing two here for this character so let's start with this one I will see if we jump in a game that's already started or if it just begins so it's a game that is already uh, already more likely to the middle end game right now so we can see it because at the bottom right of the screen I already have a uh, 1,500 more solar, which is the in-game currency. Uh, okay, so let's buy all my stuff. I'm gonna get some distance, damage over time, split, yes, yes. Uh. Okay, let's start with that and see what we can do. That's the hard part, when we you join a game that's already started, it's harder to get a good score on it. So I'll see what I can do about that. So this guy gonna die to my poison. I'm just gonna leave and go. Except if I if find out the uh, heal po like here, health item. It can regenerate his health. So what's our my team against who? Okay, so I have me, uh, this girl is a sniper girl, does a lot of damage burst. Uh, this one is Froggy G, a quick in and out damage dealer, but not really tanky. Uh, here they got a uh, Durple, which is a powerful tanky machine. Uh, they got this guy, which can put out mines everywhere, shoot laser, fly in the air, and dr shoot a healing wave around him, like an AoE eel. And there's Leon, which is going to be invisible for most of the part of the game, and just try to backstab you. So we'll see what I can do about that. What? Okay, so this guy has a pretty powerful mind. I'm not used to this. So whenever you die, there's uh, usually a small cooldown. This one gonna be longer than usual because we are almost at the mid end game. Uh, and if you're in the cooldown, not when you're going down and getting some solar in the meantime, but when you're in the cooldown, you can buy some items from the shop, which is pretty good to do. So instead of wasting time and stopping at the shop after that, you can just buy it before. I'm not sure it will be really good. At in this game since I just joined it way too late. But that's what happens sometimes when you try to to reach uh, like you sh you're j joining a game with the joining system and just gonna send you to oh I'm gonna get destroyed. What? This stun is way too long. And this guy is gonna be just cornering me, dropping mines on my head. I wasn't able to throw some 
my poison on him, so that sucks. Okay. This guy. This guy is annoying. His mine are way too powerful. See, 78 damage. That's way too much. So, that's pretty much it for this game. They are already at our core, so. Nothing much I can do about that. Time yet. We're gonna be losing it for sure. So it's gonna be a bit uh, hard this one to get through. Sorry if I didn't talk it, I was concentrating. Okay. But I'm pretty sure we'll find a, another game after this one when we can start from the beginning and maybe uh, do something better. Uh, I can't do, can do anything with these mines everywhere. There we go. Two mines and dead. That's ridiculous. That's just ridiculous. This guy just gonna chill there, playing some mine. So that's one thing that time sucks. Uh, it's when you get in a game and it's already too late. So we'll see. See what I can do about that. But we are almost done. Because if you've never seen any videos about this game or never played it before, the objective of the game is to destroy the enemy core, which is this time this is a war core and they are already destroying it. Just bad. Try to defend it the best I can. Putting some plants here. This is gonna attack automatically any enemies going down to this place. Just miss my throw. Sucks. Okay. Just gonna try to push. Tower, if we can do it, that can be a good thing. No, don't die, go away. This guy, man. Ah, oh, you have to be kidding me. To defend, seems like they don't want me to go in front. Thing is, it doesn't really matter at this point in the game because our team won't be able to push. We have two squishy in front. Uh, gonna put it out by seconds. So the way to be able to put down some saplings is there's a maximum. Oh God. A maximum of four that I can put down, but I have to bite into enemy to get the parts to be able to create them. So here I got two down, eat that one, and I can put two more. 
So currently I'm the maximum I can do about this guy. Hope my team will be able to push in. That could be awesome if we win this one. Well, we'll see. Or core is not doing that well. It's under 50 percent. I'll try to unleash these little butts on the top. Oh, that's nice. It's gonna replace any that is about to die. But man, damage. So these little saplings, I'll choose the option to make them shoot two bullets instead of one at a time, and I've upgraded their damage dealing. So they are pretty dangerous. Instead of just having four, it's like if I have eight of them right now here. So it's a pretty good defense. Here again, I shoot it in the air. Please can be sure that this is up all the time they are trying to push. Hoping to achieve something with this one. I'm sorry that you have to watch a game where I'm just defending the core. Uh, that's usually not I do. Actually, more of the attacking character, but whatever. Just gonna send this through. And let's defend the core. Oh my god. Why? Okay, he's gonna die. I'm really not good today, I just miss again one of my throw. I'm just gonna try and send some of his mining thing. This guy sucks. When you probably don't know how to play the monkey guy, oh man, it is hard to do something against him. Alright, let's go down. At least. Can I augment the damage? No, the L. I'll augment my damage. Uh, this game is not gonna handle well. As you can see, these guys are a good defense to have. I'll try to put them a bit farther in. I don't know if they will block the main one. Let's go. I'll get the kill. Thank you. This time I got these one. I put some health over time boost on these guys so they're gonna auto heal themselves. Hoping to achieve to defend the core. Oh my god. I didn't saw that one coming. Sorry guys, that's my fault. Yeah. Wasn't able to do anything and just lose a rank. Well, that's alright. So let's see if we can jump in in a different game.